All right. Uh, testing. Testing. <clears throat> Let us begin. Ugh, creaky chair. <clears throat> Right, uh, time to do some Gordon lines, I suppose. Hooray! And I also got, uh, a boiler near me, so possibly this is gonna sound bad, but let's just find out whatever. I'm the creator, I can do whatever I want. <laughs> it was an honor having you on my railway. Oh, wait, no reach, not that. Hi, Timothy! Oh god, no, no, that was bad. That was already bad. Alright, Red Leaf, here are your lines. Just let me get on the app, and yeah. About that, because you have been increasing your shunting skills, I have let you stay here to be head shunter. Thank you all, and have a good rest of the day. Timothy and... Timothy and Amber knew... Timothy and Amber knew how upset Thomas was, so they tried their best to cheer him up. And... If I don't make it to Knapford, can you tell the other engines I said thanks for being there with... Ah! Hang on, let me retry that one, sorry. I got two in motion. <clears throat> Man, what a simp! Oh god, voice crap. <laughs> I voice crap now. Cons of being through puberty. <laughs> the next day, it was time for Timothy to leave. Everyone from the state, everyone from the station was there. Even Jeffrey was going to miss him. It's kind of yeah. You sure had. Good night, everybody. <laughs> We're yours. Mine now. Come on, Tim. I'm just having a bit of fun. Fine. I wasn't interested in it anyway. What? Oh, man. Poor Timothy. You say, Thomas, there are times when an engine can, uh... Well... Um... Let's just say... Hey, Thomas! Look on the bright side. At least you're now the best shunter in the yard. Oh. Thomas! Are you here? Look, Thomas. I know I've been a little rude to you. Okay, a lot. But I want to make it up to you. I spoke to Mr. Patrick, and he said that I can escort you to Sodor, so that nothing bad happens to you along the way. Because I miss Timothy too, and I don't want you to get hurt. Ready? Well, here we are. Goodbye, Thomas. That's what friends are for, right? Will do. You know, I lost my sister once. Really? You never told me this before. What happened? You see, before I worked in Brighton, I lived in a small town pulling nothing but passengers. But one day, the railway was put to a close. And me and my sister were going to be chosen to be the official passenger train on another railway. This railway. But only one of us could go, while the other had to stay and be scrapped. <gasps> That's awful! But... Why only one of you? Mr. Patrick didn't have enough money on him for the two of us, so my sister decided to stay behind. That was the last I ever saw of her. I'm sorry for your loss.
And so, ladies and gentlemen, that includes the behind the scenes of Thomas and Timothy. Thank you all for watching this. It was it was a lot of fun, and it just means so much that you all appreciate all my hard work. And I hope you enjoy other stuff. <laughs> I don't know what to say now. <laughs> Thanks. And that's all of them.